has got to stop your coming with me to the barber shop. Dad! The place where your kids can grow. <laughs> You're entering Hamlin. Where status is status quo. <laughs> You're entering Hamlin. And you'll find that Hamlin is just bursting with opportunity. I could be a pilot. What an address to settle for being a stewardess. Evening news. <laughs> It is simply beyond me why you would cause a disruption in school like this. Must you noodle on that thing all the time? He's trying to write a song, Dad. I'm trying to learn how to play. Forget about learning how to play, son. Learn how to work if you want to get somewhere in life. When I got the call from your principal saying you'd been strumming that instrument during medieval history, Thank you. Well, do you realize how embarrassing that is for me, the mayor of Hamlin, to hear that his son is causing a disturbance like that? <laughs> really, Mick, what were you thinking? What was he thinking about what? I was thinking that medieval history was medieval. Well, I think that's very clear-headed of you, son. No, Mom. What I mean is, it was boring. Medieval history is irrelevant to our modern way of oh, life. Oh, shush, Janice. Anyway, I had an idea for a song. A, a song? song? Play it for us, Mick. Uh, okay. Here goes. I want to wake up one morning to a world that's brand new. I want to look out my window at a brand new view. I want to go to a doorway that opens wide and find a brand new planet waiting for me outside. I want a brand new sidewalk and a brand new street. I want a brand new song that's got a brand new beat. And when I lift my voice and sing the melody, I want that brand new world to sing along with me. Oh, Mick, that was great. Mom, Dad, wasn't it great? Oh, that's lovely. Nick, wasn't that lovely? Very nice, Mick. Very nice. But we're not living in a brand new world. We're living in the regular old world where a man has to buckle down and work to get by. I'm taking this. No, Dad! Traption away from you until you stop sloughing off on your schoolwork. Mom! There, there, dear. It'll be all right. No. <laughs> What about me, Dad? I'm sloughing off, too. Don't you want to yell at me? Girls don't have to get good grades as long as they're smart about who they marry. Isn't that right, Pat? <laughs> Dad, that attitude is medieval. Don't talk back to your father, Janice. Remember, he's also your mayor. But I want to travel and see the world and be an astronaut and a surgeon and own my but own a restaurant. Boy. A boy becomes a man, and a man becomes a provider, a protector, a leader. 
If you miss out on your education, son, the world will pass you right by. Now, <clears throat> if you'll excuse me, I've got some important calls to make. Dad, look! Look! Did, Did you, you see, see that? that? See what? Hello? Who is this? Crazy crank callers. Hello, Mr. Jones. This is Mayor Nick Dixon. Our meeting starts at 3.30 sharp. Let's synchronize our watches. Psst! Nick! Uh-huh. I've got 2.15 and 17 seconds. Be back in time for dinner. This town has an emergency. It starts with R and ends with T. And in the middle, give yourself an A. Great. There's rats on every fence and tree. They lounge around so lazily. We scare them. Boo! They don't run away. Our parents just don't see them. Either that or they don't care. It's handling everything I said it was, or ain't it? Ricky Dink Dink, you have exceeded my wildest oh, expectations. Thanks, sir. Hamlin is ripe for ratification. These cowardly Hamlin folk don't even lift a finger against us. Oh, yeah? <laughs> hey, back off, King. Don't you know who this rat is? Oh, oh. Uh on the sidewalk. Now break it up. Some folks call me Wonder, and some folks call me Why. Some call me the Pied Piper, but you can call me Sly. Hi, uh, I'm Mick. And I'm his sister Janice. Can you really get rid of the rats, Mr. Sly? Sure, check it out. Ah, 
Take that, you rat. Oh, that guy is good. <laughs> Why'd you stop, Sly? That's just a demonstration. I think my point's been made. I do this for a living, and the piper must be paid. You mean you're in the musical pest control business? Part time. <laughs> What do you do the rest of the time, Sly? The rest of the time, I'm a crowd pleaser, a two teaser, <laughs> a hot twister, and a cool breezer. <laughs> So you just wander around pleasing and breezing and driving away rats. That's about it. Wow. Hey, let's get Dad to hire Sly to drive away the rats for good. You're a genius, Janice. That's a good idea. Let's do that. Come on, guys. My, my, I feel brand new. I can't believe Jerry was late. No, I just can't believe it. Oh, I don't know. I'm so bored, I can't even stand it. Did you hear about Mrs. Jones? Is there a thing going on? All right, everyone, the time is now 3.32. Let's synchronize our watches. We just finished synchronizing our watches, dear. There may have been slippage, Mrs. Dixon. He is right, Pumpkin. Oh. Dad! Dad! We found someone who can get rid of the rats! <gasps> who is that? You mean, what is that? Some folks call me Wonder, and some folks call me Why. Some call me... Just a moment. I'm sure your name has a fascinating history, young man, but as you can see, we're very busy Dad! and... Dad! This is Sly, and he can... Don't interrupt, Janice. It's not polite. <clears throat> Dad! He can drive the rats away. Hmm? What's that, Mick? With his music, he can drive the rats away. Drive rats away? Music? What on earth are you talking about? Musical pest control, Dad. Sly cuts loose and the rats vamoose. Uh -huh. yeah. Yeah. Uh -huh. Mick, Janice, we don't have rats. Mm, uh, actually, Mr. Mayor, my kids said they saw some rats in the playground yesterday. Um, mine too. Yeah, there was one in my lunchbox. Mm -hmm. Judy, mm -hmm. me too. See? 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 We told yeah. you. You can't be serious. Rats here in Hamlin, the perfect small town? Why, it's unthink... Oh! oh. A ball. <gasps> Uh-oh. Sly, show Dad how it's done. <laughs> oh. <laughs> oh, wow. <laughs> I call 
a chance to freeze. I took all that cheese. I tantalized it with your nostrils with a little whiff of cheese. Yeah, soon they start to dance. They jiggle and they prance. And when those rats go acrobats, you know they haven't got a chance. Haven't got a chance. And that's the way the two go. When you hire me, all your troubles soon go into history. That's the way I like it. I hope you like it too. We do. Oh, my name is Sly. I'm a magic guy, and I'm here to do a job for you. Did you see what he did? Yeah. yeah. To the wall? <sighs> Dad. Somebody's going to pay for that. Dad, you should hire Sly to get rid of the rats. Janice, keep still. Let's see. This little accident happened at exactly 3.37 p.m. Do you all agree with that assessment? 3.36? <gasps> you should hire Sly to drive the rats away, Dad. It won't cost much. Will it, Sly? Nothing that you can't afford. Oh, uh-huh. And how would you know what I can afford? I can tell by the price you've already paid. You talking riddles. Listen, name your price, and if it's reasonable, we might consider... Normally, I charge good bread to put a case like this to bed. But since I had a real good year, and since I like your children here, I'll make those rats hit the road, Jack, for the chopper you got stashed out back. What? My Harley. Wow, Dad. You used to ride this? Yes, son, way back, before I was mayor. It's hard to picture you on this machine, Mr. Mayor. <laughs> Very hard. <laughs> Me and Marilyn, and your mom, we went places. We did things. <laughs> days are long gone. I don't have time for such nonsense. Well, since you never ride it anymore... You can, you train, can train it to slide to get rid of the rat. Ow! No. I mean, it's out of the question. This bike must be worth thousands. Gee, Mr. Mayor, it looks like a wreck to me. I said no. If we have a few rats, we'll set traps like decent people do. And you, Mick, Janice... What have your mother and I told you about talking to strangers? I'm sorry, Mr. Wonder Why, or whatever your name is. I think you're a bad influence on my children. I must ask you to go. <gasps> then I'll be on my way. Maybe I'll stay for another day or two, for you might change your mind. And if you do, you'll find me down beside the rushing river. <gasps> I'm the piper. I deliver. He wasn't a bad influence, Dad. You didn't have to kick him Shush, out. Shush, Janice. You have no idea what you're talking about. He could play. I, I mean, really play. 
I'll bet he would have taught me a lick or two. Tell you what, Mick, you can take music lessons down at the Y. I'll bet they can teach you how to play all the hot new sounds. I don't want to take music lessons at the Y, Mom. I want to play guitar like Sly. Well, Sly is gone, and he's not coming back. <laughs> Take Marilyn away. <laughs> <laughs> Rake, assemble the rotten file. Yes, sir! <laughs> Beloved family, the last hurdle to the ratification of Hamlin Town has just been sent packing. We are now free to come out of hiding and turn Hamlin into Rat Town, U.S.A. Charge! All right, you go high! You go low! Move it, Toots! I want to see some action! Toots, squeak! Is your friend. Why not wallow in your friend? It's very simple, people. The people around the rats are in! Oh, 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 oh. <laughs> Have a deal? Yes. Yes, you can have the bike. Just do that voodoo that you do so well. Get us out of this mess. Sly! Wait, wait. Do you have to kill the rat, Sly? Jobs like this tend to be abrasive. 
But for you, Mick, I will be persuasive. War is done, the rats have won, the humans must retreat. What? And watch the fabulous swimming rats. Did he say swimming rats? I could have sworn I heard him say swimming rats. Admit you lost the rats of boss. Come on and grab a seat. Okay. To watch the fabulous swimming rats. Their diving skill will thrill you. They are bold and brave and brash. You haven't been done to you've seen them splash with great panache. The show is free today, but gee, we could be charging cash to see the fabulous swimming rats. What are you guys doing? Step right up. Don't be bashful. Dive right in. Make a splashful. Hey, cut it out. Come on, a little respect. Ooh. Ho, ho. The one, the leader of the pack. Who, me? The most fabulous, fabulous swimming rat. Don't hesitate, you know you're great. But hold your talent back. My talent? You incredible, fabulous swimming rat. Just make a lunge and take the plunge. You're sure to get a ten. A ten? You're slick and sleek and your physique is pure only the end. Uh -huh. But act today, I'm sad to say this chance won't come again to play the fabulous swimming. Well, if you truly think I should. Fabulous swimming. Oh, I hope that I make good. Fabulous swimming. Get your cameras out. Yes, lens caps off. Judges, are you watching? Here I go. display of uh, <laughs> musical pest control. <laughs> Dad? What? Oh, yes. You'd, of course, want to get paid now. <clears throat> As mayor of Hamlin, I thank you for the service you have provided here today. And in gratitude for said service, I offer you this handsome, almost brand new set of golf clubs. <gasps> I assure you, these are much better than that old bike. Sure to knock five strokes off your game. Hmm? Okay. Then how about this fine collection of National Geologic magazines? Goes back generations in the attics of my family. No? 
1939 World's Fair commemorative plate? The Harley yeah, will be real. just the stuff. I've always wanted one that tough. Yes, well, you know, that bike has some serious problems. The brakes, for instance, don't work, and... I don't need brakes. No, I imagine you don't. Dad, just bring out the Harley. It slides now. He earned it. No, he didn't. <gasps> what? He didn't earn it. What he did just now was, was too easy. It only took him, what, about three minutes? As Hamlin's mayor, I worked 42.7 hours this week. I didn't earn nearly enough to buy a motorcycle. Why should he, just for a song? A deal's a deal. Bring out the wheels. No. <gasps> just one more chance, mayor. It's your last, before I turn the hourglass. <sighs> My answer is final. Look out! He's going for his guitar! <gasps> Well, that got rid of him. I guess I better go. I guess I better fly. Before the cold winds blow, I better say goodbye. The wind is quiet now. No rustling in the trees. My heart is crying now. I know where I should be. I know where I should be. I gotta climb the mountain. Dad, don't go. We'll talk to Dad. Make him change his mind. We want you to stay for supper. We're having macaroni and cheese. Mmm, sounds good. But I gotta split. I'm in a place where I don't fit. I had a dad like yours once, too. And he never did what he promised to do, either. Daddy doesn't treat me right. <laughs> Mama doesn't kiss goodnight. Surely this is not my home. All I do is feel alone. Gotta find the fast lane out of here. Suddenly my path is clear. I gotta climb the mountain. Where will you go, Sly? I've got a cave up in that peak where I can find the peace I seek. Goodbye, Mick. Be sure to practice your guitar. Someday you might be a star, no matter what Dad says. <laughs> and you, oh, there's no end to what you can do. That is, if they don't block your way. Keep warm. Be cool. Bye, all. Goodbye, Sly. Daddy doesn't let me play. They never want to play. Doesn't hear a word I say. They always turn away. Suddenly I seem to find my own voice. Suddenly I have a choice. I'm gonna climb the mountain. mountain. There's something happening here, but I don't know what it is. Do you, Mr. Jones? Oh. Oh. Janice, there'll be no macaroni and cheese for you tonight, young lady. Nick, I forbid you to take one more step. I'm step. going, Dad. Let go! Oh. The best I can. Mama doesn't kiss her now. You said you were too old for that. What's behind us looks so cold. Cold? Up ahead, new worlds unfold. From this moment, we kiss our past goodbye. From now on, we're following Sly. We gotta climb the mountain.
So I tied that snake up in a knot with a quick slick lick that was extra hot. <laughs> <laughs> I really love hearing your stories, Sly. I love telling them to you, Prince. You're the perfect audience. Um, Sly, are we there yet? <laughs> we got a ways to go yet, Princess. See that hole in yonder wall? That's this group's next port of call. But how will we... You've got an axe. I'm glad you could bring it. But man, you've got to learn to swing it. Say, this trip's too long. I'll tell you what. I'll rustle up a quick shortcut. Something wrong? Well, Sly, it's just that it, it's dark. It's dark? All right. Let there be light. No, no, I, I mean it's stark. It's empty. There's nothing here. No, no, my man, Prince Mick, you're wrong. It's all right here, just for a song. Look at me, Mick. We've got everything right here and right here. Well, this doesn't look like any everything I've ever seen. Okay. Then tell me, little royalty, right now, where would you rather be? The moon! London. The London? moon? The I could be the first girl on the no, moon! No, London is where all the big rock oh, stars hang out. You always get there. to do what you want. That is so I not true. No, whoa, 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 stop, stop. Hey, chill, you stop. Huh? You're both right. <laughs> London and the moon coming right up. <laughs> Jolly good. Bad and gear. Swing in London on the moon is a place you can be floating like a red balloon. Light as cotton candy London on the moon, the moon London on the moon, the moon, the moon, the moon, the moon Indubitably <laughs> Many skirts and bell bottoms Cruise the street can I be Power cards and sit tossed Rock Westminster Abbey London on the moon, the moon London on the moon, the moon, the moon, the moon, the moon Kaleidoscopic diamond sky A woman winking her third eye Is swinging London on the moon You want cool. The 
Did you find anything, Mrs. Robinson? No. The detectives say we have to turn back. It's too dark for the helicopters, Nick, and the dogs are just running in circles. Ah, uh, it's been two days. The exact time since the children disappeared is 51 hours, 17 oh, minutes, Oh, stop it. Will you just stop it? Certainly, Mr. Mayor. They can't have disappeared without a trace. Pat, I'm worried. Come on, Nick. We'll search again in the morning. So, my sweets, what you want for eats? Cheeseburgers! Marshmallows! Ice cream! Popcorn! Bubble gum! Macaroni and cheese? <laughs> Don't you let me provide the dinner music for this ride. Nick? Do you hear it too? Yes, it sounds like it's at the sign. It's you. 
What are you doing? It's nearly 3 a.m. Is it? I left my watch at home. Oh, my goodness. Oh, my. You really think he'll see it? Who, Mick? No, I meant that musician fellow. Sly. I don't know. I don't know what he sees. I've been carrying this everywhere for three days. Has your hand always shaken like that? No, it just started yesterday. Strangest thing. Nick, you've got gray hair. Do I? Oh, I guess I do. Pat, these lines on your face, they weren't there yesterday. He said before I turn the hourglass. lava surfing three days in a row now. Abby and Jerry love it. It isn't even real, Mick. How can they love something that's not real? Oh, you loved performing open heart surgery on that walrus, didn't you? Well, well... <laughs> yes. <laughs> it's fun up here in the cave with Sly. It's more fun than we ever had with Mom and Dad. Yeah. Wonder what they're doing now. Probably playing bridge. Oh, paying bills. Watching the Hunkly Brunkly report. Boring. Up here, we all get to do what we really want. All the time. Most of us do. But what about you, Mick? Are you getting to do what you really want? I don't know. All I really want to do is play like Sly. But he won't show me how. Have you asked him? He obviously doesn't want... Have you asked him? Well, no, but... Come on, Mick. What's up, Buttercup? Mick wants to ask you something. Shoot, Brew. Yeah, I was wondering if I could try your guitar sometime. Uh-huh. Think you can handle it, Mick? Probably not. But I'm eager to try. I want to, more than anything. I know you do. I've just been waiting for you to ask. Go on, Mick. Give us a lick. Whoa, don't go at it hard just yet. Treat it gently, like a pet. That's right. That's right. I want to make things happen when I play, like you do. Huh, <laughs> to do that? You gotta climb a lot of mountains, Prince. What's the first step, Sly? The first step? Well, to start, play only what's in your heart. <laughs> what's in your heart? Yeah, that's the thing. I'll put your fingers to each string, and then we'll see what's happening.
everybody here? Yes, yes sir. we're yes, always sir, right here. here. What's new? Yes, dear, everybody's here. Can you hear me? We've paid you what you asked. Obviously, we don't have much time left. <laughs> When you took our children away, you took all the youth out of this town. And now, if we're ever going to see our kids again, it will have to be soon. Please, let our children come home. Well, we've said it again. <laughs> Come on, Nick. Let's go have some tea. Wait. Do you hear something? Looking up at the mountains high Where the snows and the eagles fly Remember our last goodbye. See how they run. I forgot how a young heart yearns. Now I know how an old heart yearns. For that day when your child returns, daughter and son. When they come home, oh, we'll know what to do. We'll make sure our love is shining through. And we'll start out every day like you When they come When they come Yeah, there you go, you're getting it now, man Feel the strumming across your soul Take command out but lose control Get the feel at the good times roll Somehow you know can do it, we're by your side. Take us all on a magic ride. Tighten up now, but let it slide. And, and then, then there you go, go, you go, you go. There you go, you know just what to play. And there's no one standing in your way. And it's like a special holiday. them old. No, no, no. You did, by leaving. Dad is willing to pay you now. Take us home. Yeah, 
Yes, like, take us okay. home. Yes, Jesus, like, home. Janice is right. Please, it's what's best. We wanna go take home. you home? <laughs> take you home? Home is where the heart is, dear. And all our hearts have moved up here. Right? If you won't take us, we'll go ourselves. Come on, Mick. Mick, Mick, think who you are. You just broke through on my guitar. I taught you how. You've got to stay. I can't just let you walk away. Thank you, Sly, for everything. Really, it's been unbelievable. I'll never forget what I learned here and everything we did. But we have to go. In here. No, no, you're free. Just stay with me. Down there, there's freaks, antiques, and geeks. There's nothing in this cave but peaks. <laughs> no valleys, no. We're always soaring. Why goose step back to a life that's boring? Move those rocks. Move them yourself. Uh, uh, uh. You're on your own now, Johnny B. Good. Just play what's in my heart, right? That's right. You can do it, Mick! Come on, Mick, you can do Come it. On, just try, man, you play, can do it! Mick, play! We had some fun here, didn't we? We all became a family. You really would abandon me? 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 Alone again. Naturally. Come on, you guys. Come on, everybody. You gotta keep on. No, no, no. Keep running. Come on, let's go. We we can't get past that. Um, let me try something. I'll do what Sly did. We can see daylight up ahead, Mick! We're almost out! Come on! brother fell because he was green. Well, you could have helped him. He loved you. 
We all did. But you know we can't stay here with you. We all can't live in a cave and, and go lava surfing. Mick wanted to make real music for real people. I want to see the real world. Real life. It's something you don't want to miss. You know what I mean? Yeah, I guess I do. to Hamlin. today. Our children have come home. How long have we been gone? I don't know. I've lost track of the time. But he called for you. We all called for you That's every right. night. We were always yeah. there for you. Huh? We never gave up hope. And we heard you, Dad. That's why we're here. Sly showed us things, taught us things, and he saved Mick's life. Sly! I bet you could bring this town back to life with your playing, just like you brought Mick back to life. Uh-uh, Princess. Mick's the one whose heart should get that big job done. Mick? Yeah, Dad, you should hear Mick play. Oh, gee, I don't know. Mick, you can. You have to. I believe in you. I can't. Can. 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 You can do it, Prince. You can. Show this town that you're the man. Celebrate Happy 
have any wrinkles anymore. I can stand up again. Look at our clothes. Woo! These boots. <laughs> oh, they're made for walking. <laughs> oh, it's me. I'm back. an idea. Why doesn't Janice plan a trip for us all? I think it's time for the Dixon family to hit the highway. Sounds great, Dad. But you know, Hamlin is looking pretty perfect to me right now. 